Jasmine and John C. Sanders can relate to one another like no other lady statesman can. We're able to help each other on certain things, and then, like, we know each other well on the court, and that's an advantage that I have uh, compared to some other folks, I mean, other players. It's good, actually. It's a, a big bonus seeing that we like to play uh, with each other and we can read each other well. Um, it's just great to have her around. And the reason why they feed off each other so well is because they are twins fraternal twins, both of whom Coach Rushing knew she wanted to sign out of Brandon High. I wanted both of them. Yeah, Absolutely okay. wanted both of them the same. I knew what they could bring to this program. Uh, one was a guard, one was a post, and uh, they're tremendous young ladies. They're winners, you know, and, and they really love the game. And the Sanders twins say it was never their intention to play college basketball together. But after confiding in one another during the recruiting process, they came to the conclusion there were advantages of staying together they just could not pass up on. And then we thought it's going to be a good thing for all my parents as well because um, they won't have to try to go to different facilities and different games trying to go this, this way and that way. So We get to room with each other for one. <laughs> Um, and she brings a little bit of, of home here to the uh, to the room, so that you know I, I do sometimes get homesick, but with her around, uh, it just goes away. Which begs the question: Having never really been separated, do they ever crave for space? No, not really. <laughs> I mean, we roommates, and we've always been roommates, and like you said, conceived together and everything. She's uh, more protective. <laughs> when you say she's protective, and what do you mean? Like just she got my back. Oh, she got your back. Yeah. <laughs> and you got hers. You yeah, got her. yeah, definitely. Yeah.